Hello everyone. This is your host Abdul Majid Mangriyo. And today we are going to learn how to use HTTP request and consume some services in MuleSoft. So let's get started. Uh, this is Endpoint Studio. Firstly, we are going to create a Mule project. Uh, let's name it like um, HTTP request uh, demo and leave everything as default. Just hit the finish. Yeah, the project is created. So this is the development environment. Over here, we are going to need a flow. We created a flow. Just click and drag. Okay. Let's name this flow as a um, SRTP uh, request demo and then to invoke this flow we need http listener we're just going to click it and that will be dragged and then uh, we need a logger to print okay entered to request demo pi and then um, to consume services, we are going to need um, HTTP request. Okay, so let's configure this uh, listener. So uh, you can see uh, my previous uh, uh, video where I just explained how to configure your API and exp expose your, um, your endpoint. So we, we used the HTTP listener there. So this is the one like uh, we need to create the configurations for that. So the default configurations are like 8081 port and the default protocol is like HTTP. So we are going to leave everything as it is. And um, over here, we are going to give a name to our um, API service like uh, uh, request demo. So this will be our um, endpoint for uh, this HTTP listener. Going forward, this is the request component. And over here, we need a configuration. We need to configure it. And uh, let's go for uh, like uh, what we are going to hit. So I just uh, randomly picked some services from Google. Like uh, this is the data we are going to consume in our Mule API. So let's get started. Uh, first, um, this is the uh, request component. So first we need to create the con its configuration. So just hit this plus sign. And over here, um, let's fill up it like a host. We are going to provide the host and uh, leave everything as it is. Just press OK. So here you can see it has rendered um, this host. But one more thing like uh, we need to uh, see like uh, whether what protocol it is following. So let's copy. Yeah, it is following HTTPS. So for that, we need to configure it as a uh, HTTPS protocol. Okay, then just okay. And uh, furthermore, furthermore, uh, we need this uh, path slash users. So that is going to be um, inserted here. Okay, so now we have a complete path over here. So by default, our method type is get and we also need a get request for this call. And just um, hit the save button. Okay. And uh, now just try to deploy this application. Run as mule application. Okay. So, 
okay while this application is being deployed let's copy the path which we just said for our listener basically the purpose of this uh, http listener is to invoke um, this flow so it has a particular path we just uh, mentioned and uh, we are going to invoke it so let's wait for it to be deployed okay so our application is deployed let's go for the postman here we are going to hit the services like for instance this was the name and the default port was like 881 and the um it was a get request so let's hit it send yeah we got the response this is the user response which we just got from uh, uh, from that service which we just invoke using this request http request so um basically we just uh, uh, hit this service uh, using HTTP listener and uh, going forward, uh, reaching here, uh, rec HTTP request just uh, consume some services and it just uh, uh, forwarded us all the data which was needed. So that was all guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe our channel and uh, please share. Thank you.